This has become quite a place, hasn't it? Has everyone evacuated crossing the Blade Drifts? I think they escaped to Tolbekia, around Torum. Maybe the ships are back in service now. Anyone would think of running away under a sky like this. Okay, I'm gonna go shopping. Can I join you? Uh, yes. You all wait up at the inn. Okay. Traveling under a sky like this? We're short of customers now, so you are really welcome. Looks like the Teagles got away too. Even with the road through Emmett Hill open, I'm still worried. I love port towns. They always have stuff. Even in times like this. Looks like things just might work. What did you buy? One of each formula crest and container parts. What are you trying to do? I'm making a device that will converge the spirit's powers. A kind of makeshift Dane Nomos. Dane Nomos? I wonder what Duke is doing now. I don't know, but he seems totally obsessed. <sighs> Patty, what is it? Huh? I'm famished. Want me to make you something? I do appreciate the offer, but I must decline. I'd blow up like a pufferfish if I ate now. Sleeping is the best way to distract oneself from an empty tummy, so good night. They say kids need sleep to grow up, but I doubt Patty's growing up anytime soon. Rita's gonna need a bit more time, too. We should catch some shut eye while we can. Yes. Please wake up. I'm up, I'm up. Was that Patty just now? I'm worried about her, running off by herself in the middle of the night. Yeah, but it kind of seemed like there was something weighing on her. Maybe she was thinking about Eifried. Judith! I didn't realize you were awake. Now that you bring it up, she hasn't said a peep about Eifried lately. Rita, you're up too? And so is this old man. I'm going to check on her. I'll be right back. I'll come with you. It's too dangerous to go wandering around alone. It's still pretty risky, just the two of you, Judith, darling. Allow me. I'll escort you. I'm going too. Well, I guess if everyone's going... What's the matter? Hey, sleepyhead, we're going out for a bit. You sit tight and hold the fort. Huh? Where are you going? Don't just leave me here! I guess even the twerp wants to tag along. Alright, then we'll all go and take a quick peek. The ring's not going to change form any more than it already has. It sure has gotten a lot of new capabilities since we first got it. Ah, but it's kind of sad to think that this is all we'll get from it. You were hoping it would get even more, huh? Yeah, me too. I thought I'd be able to do a lot more things. Too bad. What else do you want it to do, Captain Carol? Hmm, let's see. I think it'd be kind of fun if it let us talk with animals. That would be great. I'd like to talk to Rapide. Nah, I think I'd prefer some more practical capabilities myself. Don't you think it's already pretty practical as it is? Nah. Now if it could tell me what you're thinking, Judith, then maybe. Or if it could make pretty girls fall in love with old Raven. Or if it could see through your clo- Ha! Ow! You just want it for your perverted fantasies. It's a sorcerer's ring, not a sleazebag ring. Oh, I've had enough of this. I should kill you! Oh, hell. Hey, old man. 
What do you wish the ring could do now? Oh, uh, go back in time. Shut me up. Wait! What are you all doing here? We could ask you the same question. Why the solo trip out here, hmm? We've gathered the spirits and are about to embark on a life-or-death mission. I just wanted to settle my own affairs before that. Are you talking about Eifried? This is my problem and mine alone. No one else should have to bear the burden. You say that, but there's really no reason you should go alone. Uh, hey, that's the Atherum. What is it doing here? Did you call it here, Patty? I thought I saw you holding up the Maristella. So the Maristella is a device that summons that ship. It's reaching out for its other half. Meaning its other half is on that ship? But the Maristella is... Huh? Does this have anything to do with that problem you mentioned? Aye. Then let's go. Huh? What are you waiting for? You're going to come with me? You know there's no way we'd let you go by yourself. My thanks. But I will be the one to settle what needs settling. You got it. The boat's over there. Time to embark. Hey, does that mean that Eifried is on that ship? Who knows? Guess we'll have to see when we get there. This looks like fun! Yuri! Our love will conquer all! Okay, okay. Does he hide his love by being cold? So you were looking for that treasure that I freed had hidden, right, Patty? So you could meet him and get your memories back. I... And then you ended up finding the Maristella, right? Well, yes and no. The treasure Eifried was searching for was the Maristella. What? So you were both after the exact same thing? Then will you be able to find him now? If I use the Maristella, I'll find him without a doubt. Then that means Eifried must be on this ship. Well, you see... What the heck? Up there! We've defeated that monster here before, haven't we? Patty! Is that Eifried? That? It can't be, but... Whoever it is, we gotta go. Yes. I believe there was a ladder in the captain's quarters.
Cypher, it's me! Do you recognize me? Who's Cypher? I thought that was Eifried! I'm pretty sure Cypher was one of Eifried's officers. Patty! Looks like we don't have time to chit-chat. Cypher, we're settling this here and now! information. my memories and it took me a while but I finally made it back I knew it she's regained her memories I freed <gasps> that's I freed it is you been a while why is he calling her I freed I freed is me w what are you talking about cypher you recognize me yes but you must leave this place before I lose myself and turn on you once more. I will not! I came here to release you. 
from that monstrous form and from the Black Hope's fate. That day, I turned my hand against many. Committed a great sin. Is he talking about the Black Hope massacre? They would have only suffered more if you hadn't. Like the way you're suffering now. That accident turned them all into monsters. And you saved them! And yet the one who killed them lives freely in this form. You saved me! You let me escape! This time, it's my turn to save you, Cypher. I freed. You'd release me from this agony. You've done so much for me, protecting those scallywags in Siren's Harbor, and you've always supported me. But... and now... it ends. Patty. Cypher, you're the only one I... I am sorry to make you suffer so, Eifried. I'm far from the only one who suffered. You've been through so much worse, Cypher. You're my friend, so I'll shoulder your pain too. And to free you from your misery, I will kill you. Those people, they are the ones helping you through this. Good. Even without your memories, you are not alone. You are not in pain. That was all I was worried about. You've made some wonderful friends, Eifried. Here, take this. The Maris Gemma. Now I can die in peace. Go on. Do it. Cypher. It's okay to cry if you want to cry, you know. No matter how tough the situation is, crying gets you nowhere. That's my motto. Patty. I won't cry. Shedding tears is no way to pay my respects to the dear friends I've lost. I am Eifried, boss of Siren's Fang. So I... I will not cry. I will never cry. I don't want to cry. <laughs> Morning, little Miss Crybaby. So, feeling any better after that nice long cry? Uh, I'm perfectly fine. Good. So, now what are you planning on doing? Yeah, now that you got your memories back and you saw what you wanted to see. It's obvious, isn't it? I'm sticking with you guys. Are you sure that's what you want? I. It's not like I'd just abandon you to fight the Autofagos without me. Besides, I've come this far. I want to see it through till the very end. Well, we're glad to have you, Patty. <laughs> I'm glad to be here. Um, there's a lot that I've been wanting to ask, but don't know how. Well, I know we're all dying of curiosity, but you tell us when you're ready. I, I'll tell you everything when the time is right. But... What?! Judy, what happened? Wait! That's where Ospio is! What's going on?!
Ospio! What happened to Ospio? What the hell is that thing? It looks like... a mountain? Belay that, a building. Tarkaron. Huh? The spirits are telling me that's the Tower of Tarkaron. Duke, it's gotta be him. He's going to try to use that against the Autophagos. Please, let me through! You, with the long black hair! Do you have a moment? What do you want? Some people with the Knights wanted me to tell them if I saw someone with your appearance. They said they wanted to talk to you about Flynn, the new Commandant of the Imperial Knights. What? I believe you are the right person. Yeah. Hey, was it a girl with kind of cat-looking eyes and a kid with a head like an apple? Huh? Oh, yes, I suppose so. <sighs> so can I wait at the end? Yes, that's fine. I'll call them. Thank <laughs> you.